Good morning, children. Okay, children. In our previous class, we learned about two types of calendar: Gregorian calendar and Sakha calendar. And today, we are going to learn about timeline. Shall we start? Okay. Today, we have Miss Tina to teach us about. timeline and here she says good morning to you all good morning children i am miss tina today we are going to learn about timeline timeline tells us what happened and when it happened A timeline is a line of dates in which all the dates related to a certain event or person are arranged in the right order. To understand more about timeline, let us see a short story. This is Berry. Say hi to Berry everyone. Hello everyone. Glad to meet you all. I am Berry. One fine day, Berry's social teacher was teaching him about timeline. And she told that timeline is used to have a record of the events or any important occasions happened in one's life. Making timelines for events and people around us is very easy. Now, before we move on to understand timeline in detail, I'm going to give you a short assignment on timeline. Here are some guidelines which you need to follow to create your timeline. You can also take help from your parents. in order to finish this assignment okay children to create your own timeline you need to know about in which year you were born then when did you celebrate your first birthday when did you go to play school then when did you join your first grade then in which year you were promoted to second grade and then in which year you were promoted to third grade and then in which year you were promoted to fourth grade okay children you need to collect all these details from your parents and then create your timeline i shall be asking you to submit this assignment in our next class thank you children berry was very excited about this assignment as he wanted to know how he grew up and what and all the important events that he celebrated when he was a very little baby he went and asked his mother about this his mother told one by one all the events my dear berry you were born on 18th of august 2009 we celebrated your first birthday on 18th of august 2010 you went to play school in year 2012 you joined grade 1 in year 2015 you were promoted to grade 2 in year 2016 then you were promoted to grade 3 in 2017 and in year 2018 you were promoted to grade 4 Berry thanked his mom 
for giving him the information and then started making his own timeline. This is Betty's timeline which he had prepared for the assignment. Isn't it looking beautiful children? The next day his social teacher appreciated him for completing his assignment on time and also appreciated how beautifully Berry has made his own timeline. Okay children, did you all understand how Berry made his timeline? Okay, now I am going to give a similar assignment for you all. You are going to make your own timeline and send it across through WhatsApp. Thank you children. Now I hand over the class to Miss Nehalata. Hello children. Did you all enjoy Miss Tina's class? Yes. She taught us how to make our own timeline. Now let's move further into the topic. Making timelines for events and people around us is easy but the problem arises when we have to make timelines about people who lived long time ago and the events happened long ago. To solve this problem, historians used a special system of counting the years. According to this system, the birth of Lord Jesus Christ is taken as the starting point of the calendar. The years before his birth were written as BC, that is, before Christ, and years after his birth were written as AD, Anno Domini. Anno Domini is a Latin word from which it means in the year of our Lord. Common Era or Current Era CE is a calendar era used as an alternative naming of the Anno Domini era. Thus, BCE is also used in place of BC and CE is used in place of AD. That's all for today's class children. Here I have an assignment for you. What is Timeline Second one, distinguish between AD and BC. You can write these two answers either in your rough note or in your social classwork and send it to me through WhatsApp. Children, you have totally two assignments, one which was given by Miss Tina and the other one which was given by me. Thank you children. Have a great day ahead.